We see a, a, a big demand in service calls. Travis Snyder and his employees at Precision Electric are keeping it cool as business heats up. Receiving about 30% more service calls than average. Just people needing electrical service because either their panel box has failed because of uh, excessive cooling load, um, or they just have a problem that they need some, somebody out there to diagnose and see what it is. Snyder says despite the boom in business, the packed schedule can sometimes be too hot to handle. The economy's picking up anyway, so business is already good. So trying to also take care of all these service calls and take care of your customers at the same time, it can be a little overwhelming. Keeping homes cool isn't the only challenge during the triple digit days. The scorching sun and electronic gadgets aren't a good mix. You know how hot it gets sitting in your, just being in your car, uh, and then you add the direct sunlight to, sunlight to it, and it, it can be pretty damaging to the components. Electronics experts say it's CD receivers like this one that can really withstand these really hot conditions in your cars, but electronics like cell phones and iPads, the really thin screens, those are the ones that are a recipe for disaster. Discoloration of the plastics or deformation of the plastics, um, a lot of Today's electronics is held together by adhesives uh, that can separate due to high temperatures. Covering your news in Medford, Justin Matthews, News 10.